To remove a background in Photoshop 2023, all you need to do is simply go to the object selection tool. It is the fourth tool down and you want to right click in here and get yourself the object selection tool. Once you've got yourself this tool selected, you want to make sure that you have the object finder enabled. What this will do is it will allow you to preview the selection before you even create it. So as you can see, we can get ourselves a selection of the foreground or the background and of course the main subject. However, we don't even need to left click on the person. We can just simply go to select subject and 90% of the time, the AI will pick up the person that you want it to select. So then once you've got yourself the selection, you can go to select and mask. You want to click on here and get yourself in this window right here. Let's say, for example, you had certain areas, for example, this bit right here, which needed correcting. You can correct this by going to the second tool down, get yourself the edge refinement tool, and then left click on here to fix up the hair. You then want to have a look around your image and see if there's any other areas that needs correcting. So for example, this area right here as well. And then we also need to fix up the hand bit right here. You can bring back the original image by going to the third tool down and getting yourself the brush tool. By using the plus icon, you can left click on here to bring this back. So we're just going to bring this back and make it visible. Once you've done that, you then want to also add in any missing areas, for example, this part of the stool. If you want to include it, we can also use the first tool and then apply it onto here and it'll automatically detect it. Once you're happy with the changes, if you wanted to remove any color fringe or any color cast, let's say that the background was really bright and colorful and it splashed onto the hair, you can remove it by ticking this button, which will say decontaminate colors. And what this will do is it will fix up the hair and also remove any color fringe from here. However, sometimes it may look a little bit strange. For example, as you can see, we have this faded outline. So sometimes it's best to either lower the number to let's say half or just simply have it turned off. So then once you're happy with everything else, you can go to output tool, set it to a new layer with layer mask, and then go ahead and press OK. And there you go. If you would like to see more about this feature and what's new to Photoshop 2023, click on the screen and watch the next video.